While Sir Topham had went to his office to focus more on the plans, Toby was wondering where to put his trucks. All right, now let's see. Is there any sidings here to put them? Well, uh, there it's up. there obviously aren't any sidings over there, like back where I came from. Oh, there's one right there. Perfect. Now, now let's put the trucks there. He said. That's it. But then there was trouble. The signalman who had the points changed had dozed off, and by the time he woke up, was when Toby rang his bell. After Toby rang his bell, the signalman woke up and looked out the window. Oh dear, looks like Toby's coming with some trucks. Better change the points to that side, and he said. As he did change the points, he then heard another whistle. And he then remembered why he had the points switched. Because coming around the bend came Gordon. Oh no, he cried. The, the boards need to be... Oh no, what, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? He cried. And he quickly grabbed the points. And he quickly grabbed the switch and changed the points so that Toby, so that Gordon can get could get through. But then he noticed Toby coming, but changed it so that he could get through. Once again, he after noticing Gordon coming, he changed the points for Toby, but then changed it again. This happened on and on and on until the until the signalman broke the switch. And the points were now broken, and now the points stayed switched at the end, stayed in the middle, and now the points were switched onto the siding. No. Oh no! He cried as Gordon came in. Well, as Gordon and Toby came in. Gordon nor Toby noticed the noticed the broken point, noticed the changed points, but by the time they did, it was too late. Oh no! Ah! Gordon had. Luckily, nobody was hurt, but the trucks had been, but Gordon had jumped, but as soon as Gordon touched the trucks, he jumped the points and made his way onto the, onto the other line. But the trucks, on the other hand, were pushed out of the way and off, one of them was on their side, but one of them wasn't on the tracks right. Gordon... Gordon, what are you doing? What am I doing? What are you doing, Toby, you idiot? Hey, you're the one who didn't stop at the point. Hey, you're the one who wasn't paying attention. Oh, wait, no, I wasn't paying attention either. I couldn't see the points. Exactly, therefore, it was your fault. My fault? You didn't notice them either. Still, it was your fault. Now we still it was your fault. Actually, it was your fault. Plus, the trucks are off the rails. Now I need to go get help and put them back into that siding. Oh no, you don't. I I had to, I had to waste my time carrying helping the others carry a hunt a million ton a million ton crane from the docks. All the way to to your top, all the way to Fat Man's plans. You mean first of all, you mean to top him hat, right? How many other fat people do you know? And you mean, um, and you mean um, 
cranky, right? How many other, how many other million ton tr ton cranes on this island do you know? Well, well, they're they're calling out the wharf. I have no idea if he's if he weighs that much. And and there's also Carly and Big Mickey who weren't even made in merchandise yet. Just shut up, okay? Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Gordon, that was the only. Gordon, the oh, great. I could have just pulled that. Tr you could have just pulled that truck right side up, but instead you pushed it off. You pushed it off the track, and now it's on its side. Now I'm gonna need to get help. Yeah, leave. Yeah, please leave so I can have my rest. Oh no, my rest in this hiding. Oh no, you don't. Ow. You know what? Just leave her. Just leave Toby. This siding is com this this siding is occupied now. I'm using it. Oh, not for long. You're not. Ow. 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 Ah. 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 Now, bug off. But but I was gonna use that siding for the trucks. Not for long, you're not. Now bug off, you disgusting brown little cockroach. Cockroach, quivered Toby, as he sadly puffed away to go get help. Stupid little engine, said Gordon. Besides, that is, after all, what happens when you disrespect a big engine like me. But Gordon, said Percy, that was really mean of you. You really, you, I think you really do need to apologize to, God, to Toby. No, I don't need to apologize to that old, to that little brown buck, to that little brown cockroach on, roach on wheels. And this siding is mine now. Oh, not for long, it's not. And what are you exactly going to do about it, there, little Percy? Ugh. Re wow, really, really, you expect, like, you expect me to move after you pulling me, wow, I just, wow, that's be really pitiful to watch you pull a big engine, a big and strong engine like me. Go on in now, Percy, go on in now, dear Percy. Give it a shot and see what happens. Um, are you sure, Gordon? Yes. Are you absolutely sure? Cause I don't think you're gonna be you're gonna be happy with this ride you're about to encounter. Oh, stop be. Oh, stop being a stop being a little coward and just do it, Percy. All right then. Three, two, one. Uh, three, two, one. Ah! Oh, what the heck? How are you doing that? How are you doing that, Percy? Well, let's just say a little willpower is. Well, let's just say I have a little willpower.
with with me. Willpower. What? Ah! No! 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 Help me! Somebody please help me! Help me! Help me! All these nincompoops are trying to kidnap me and kill me and other stuff. No, whatever, help me! Help me!